Hi, I'm Blair Gilbert from MrHardware.com and Gilbert's Pro Hardware in St. Clair Shores here to talk about septic fields and septic field maintenance. I use several different brands. I use Aerobics, I use Ridex, I think Zep makes one. I like to change them because I'm feeling that each of these companies have different bugs and I want all the bugs I can get in my tank percolating, keeping my tank clean. This product, Robex Septic System Cleaner, is really just a bacteria treatment that I put into my drain that goes out to my septic tank to help keep the different bacteria and bugs in my tank active and composting the waste in the tank so when it turns into a fluent and goes out in the field, the effluent has been decomposed enough by these bugs so when it goes out in the field it's relatively inert. Doesn't mean it's safe but it's not as nasty as what went into the tank. So it's actually very easy to use. This is no big deal. You take the product, you pour it all in the drain all at once. Now there's a trap in this sink. So I'm going to fill this with warm, not hot water. And what this is going to do, I'm pushing the product, which is the same way I use drain cleaners. So when I use drain cleaners, this trap always is holding, say, six to eight ounces of water. So when you put drain cleaner down the drain, your drain cleaner is in the trap. It didn't go down the drain and help clear out the clog in your drain. So whenever you use drain cleaners or products like this that you're putting in through a sink that has a trap in it, always a good idea to flush it with some warm water to push the product out of the trap, out into my septic tank. Another added is, I don't pump my tank but every 15 to 20 years. The bacteria out there is alive. I'll pop the lid of my tank, I'll put a stick down into the tank to see how much mud is in the bottom of the tank. It's not really mud, is it? And I want to see how much mud's about in the tank. And if it's very shallow and my tank is all full of liquid, I'm not going to have it pumped. It's full of live bacteria that's percolating all the stuff going into the tank. So those of you that pump your tank every three to five years, you can probably quit it. And don't listen to your septic tank guy, because I'll tell you, they tell me i got to pump every five years. I went 30 years on the tank I have now, and there still is that much crud in the bottom of it. And the septic tank guy didn't believe that it's been that long. So just as an aside, that septic tanks are perpetual systems, and you're going to go a long time without being pumped. Quick money-saving tip from MrHardware.com.